Hi and welcome to this crochet stitch tutorial. I'm Yanna and I'm going to teach you step by step how this crochet stitch is done. If you really love what I'm doing here, please subscribe to my channel. And if you love what I'm doing even more, please subscribe to my newsletters where I got the link below here. And happy crocheting! Hi guys, welcome to this tutorial for the crochet cable that crosses to the left. So I'm going to use uh, the wool spun yarn from Lion Bran, super soft, I love it, and a crochet hook called Symphony Rose from Knit Pro. So to start off this tutorial I made 10 stitches, just to have an example for you. And I'm going to place uh, the crochet cables in the four middle stitches. So for crochet cables you could use both uh, four stitches as a cable, you can use three, you can use six, you can use eight, but I'm going to show you a crochet cable using four stitches today. So for this tutorial I'm, I'm going to use half double crochet stitches as a base and then for the cable I'm going to use double crochet stitches. So the first thing I'm going to do is uh, make a starting row where I'm going to do half double crochet stitches. So I'll just do a half double crochet stitch directly in the first stitch and then in the next nine. So I'm going to do nine half double crochet stitches. So when I make this tutorial I'm thinking you know the half double crochet stitch but I'm going to link to the half double crochet stitch in case you don't know it. So I'm going to do it fairly quickly. So when I finish this row I made a base for where to put my crochet cables. You can also do this as a double half as a double crochet stitch instead of a half double crochet stitch, but I prefer the half double crochet because the height of the stitch and how it looks, I think it's uh, prettier. But that's my personal opinion. So here you can see half double crochet stitches across. Then I'll start to place the cable. The first three stitches a half double crochet stitch again. So half double crochet stitch directly in the first stitch and then the next two. So the next stitch is actually the first cable crochet stitch. So I'm going to do a front post double crochet and I'm going to do go around the post of the half double crochet. So I'm going around the post and doing a half double crochet. I'm sorry, a double crochet a front past double crochet. Repeating that step, a front past double crochet. So if you don't know the front past double crochet or the back past double crochet, I also have a tutorial for that where I do the past stitches a bit slower. So if this goes too fa fast, learn the front past and back past double crochet stitch first and then do this stitch. So I've done four front pass double crochet stitches here and I'll do three half double crochet stitches at the end. So this is how the front side looks after the two rows one half double crochet row and then one row with half double crochet plus the front past double crochet. So I'll turn and I'll do the wrong side and I'll do three half double crochet stitches again. For the next four stitches after that it's the back past double crochet stitches. So I'll do four of those, so I'll go behind and do the past stitches. So I made two, two more, 
belki pasta bu crochet stitches and the last one here and I'll do three half puffs half, half double crochet sorry I always mix up the, the words like you know, past and double, uh, I'm sorry. So I'll turn again and you see the cable is starting to pop out here. So done three rows, one with half double crochet, one with half double crochet with front post stitches and then one row with half double crochet with back post stitches. And we're looking at the right side now. So on this row I'm going to actually cross the cables. So we'll do first three half double crochet stitches. So I always start with a half double crochet stitch directly in the first stitch without chains because I think the edges look nicer but you can always do um, yeah chains instead so we're ready to start crossing so the, what we're going to do is skip two stitches those two and do a front pass double crochet in this third stitch here so we go directly in the third stitch and do a front past double crochet stitch. So you see it's starting to cross here and then I'll do it in the fourth stitch, a front past double crochet stitch in the fourth stitch. So then we're going to do one in the first stitch and then the second stitch and at this point we can choose between doing it in the front or in the back or what I will call crossing to the left or the right but as I said for this tutorial we're going to do a front pass double crochet stitch uh, and a cable that are crossing to the left so I'm doing it in the first stitch so I cross directly here and go through the first stitch here and do a front pass double crochet stitch At this point we've done it in the first, in the third one, the fourth one and the fifth, uh, first one but we're also going to do it in the second one so I'll do it here then we're essentially going to skip those two stitches again because they're already done and we'll do half double crochet stitches in the last three stitches So you can see we are starting to get a cable that are crossing here. So it crosses to the left and in front of the two first two stitches we made. Um, but it's essentially in the next and final row of the cable that you actually see that the cable looks good. So we'll turn again and do three half double crochet stitches. And then we're going to do back pass double crochet stitches in the same um, way that I were, they were done. So we're going to do it in this one, this one, and we're going to do it in the ones behind here. So this one and this one. So I don't know if you can see this very well, but we're going to do it in this one. It's the first one, then the second one third one and the fourth one so in the same order they were made on the previous row so the first one that appears is here doing a back pass double crochet stitch the second one that appears so it's this one
third one was the second one we made on the previous row. And then the first one we made on the previous row is the last one we're doing it in here. And then we've done four back fast double crochet stitches and we'll do four half, uh, three half double crochet stitches to finish off the row. And this is the final row of cable. Then we'll do repeat. So here you can see we've crossed to the left in front and we've done four rows. One row with half double crochet stitches and front pass double crochet stitches. We've done one with um, back pass double crochet stitches. We've done one with the crossing and then the one last one with the back pass double crochet stitches that finish off. So you can see the cross. So when you repeat you'll do the four rows again and again and again and all the cables will cross to the left. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Comment below and let me know if you have any questions and happy crocheting!